SalesMate CRM lets you connect your multiple email accounts, allowing you to send and receive emails right from the application. It lets you associate the emails with the respective contacts along with the perfect tracking records in a single place. Connecting email with SalesMate CRM is hassle-free. Click on the profile icon on the top right and navigate to my account. Head over to the email settings on the left menu here and select your email service. You can now sync your email provider to automate email sending, scheduling and tracking. If you're using Gmail account, select Google or if it's Microsoft account, select Office 365. We also have Yahoo, iCloud and Microsoft Self hosted. In case your service provider is not listed here, relax. You can use custom SMTP to connect any email service hassle-free with SalesMate CRM. Let's dig deeper into it. Enter the from email, which should be your email address, which is needed to be connected here and an ideal name to be mentioned for your customers to identify yourself. IMAP settings. You will need IMAP host and port details to connect your account available under your email domain settings or with your IT desk. Here, IMAP username will be your email address and its password should be added under IMAP password field. If you use two-factor authentication, make sure to generate an app-specific password to be used under IMAP and SMTP password fields. The incoming mail server for an IMAP account, for example, if your email provider is example.com, the incoming mail server or hostname is likely imap.example.com. Similarly, for outbound server setting details can be furnished as instructed above. Select the protection accordingly among none, SSL or TLS. Click on connect and SalesMate will start syncing your email with a successful connection message. In case of connection error, make sure you verify the IMAP and SMTP detail furnished in the connection form. Furthermore, with Sync Folders, Sync All Folders lets you sync all the folders of your email account, whereas Sync Selected Folders Only gives you the leverage to choose the folders of your choice to sync with SalesMate CRM. Under the Delete and Archive settings, you can choose the mechanism about what should happen to emails when they are deleted or archived from either your native email application or SalesMate. You can now go ahead and update the settings. Please note, SalesMate only fetches 60 days old emails by default to start with. You may note, under Full Email Sync, only one email account can be connected. However, you can connect multiple email accounts under SMTP and BCC settings for outbound emails. Let's connect to another email ID here. Click on Add Email Account followed by your email service provider. Let us take Google as an example here. Now, choose your email account and allow SalesMate to access your Google account. That's it! Your another email is now added to your SMTP and BCC section. You can also mark default to that email which you often use to communicate. Now, when you have multiple email ID synced, when you send an email, you can choose from which email ID you would like to send the email. Apart from the full email sync, if you want to bring in incoming emails to track communication within SalesMate, you can forward your additional inboxes to this BCC address. SalesMate will automatically link the forwarded emails to existing contacts, companies, and deals. You can enable strict forwarding and enter the email address here to manage forwarding rules and receive emails only from the selective domains. Next up here, you can set email preferences. It will allow you to mark the email conversation for deals, activities, and contacts, either private, shared with your teammates and owner, or make the public to be visible in the record timeline. With default textile section, you can set the default email fonts and size. 
Using email visibility, you can choose where the new email should display under the top or bottom of the email thread. Seisma defaults to auto-association of the emails with the respective deals and the contacts if the user has only one deal against the contacts. However, you can choose your own settings to either link emails manually or automatically with the deals. If you keep the email tracking on, CSMIT will automatically track and notify you when your contacts open your emails or click through the links in your emails. Next in line is email signature. You can either create your custom signature or just add the existing using the HTML code view. Let's create one of the email signature right here. Start by selecting the table to structure your content well and adjust the column size as per the requirement. Now insert image either by using the link or upload it from the media manager. If you already have one here, select it and insert or you can upload it from your system as well. Once the image is added, as you click on it, you get an option to replace it, align it, delete it, if not required, insert any links to it, choose the display pattern as either inline style or break text, add alternate text or resize the width and height of the image just by adding the preferred sizes here. As you click on the table, you will be able to access the table properties which will allow you to delete the table, add or remove the row. Similarly, add or remove the columns, choose the table style, set the vertical alignment or the horizontal alignment. Now, add your signature details. With more text option, you can make your signature look more attractive using different font style, family, size, color and the background color if required. Clear formatting allows you to clear the styling you just made. More paragraphs option lets you align the signature content. The ordered and unordered list lets you use the numbering or simply the bullet points to showcase the URL structure in Signature. With insert links, you can add more insights to your signature. In case of unavoidable accidents, you can also undo or redo the changes. Once the signature is designed, you can now remove the border using the table properties. Keep the toggle button for place the signature before quoted text and replies on if you would like your signature to be displayed before the quoted text. Make sure you update it to save your signature. This is all about how to sync your email account and add in an attractive signature. Enjoy using SalesMate. Subscribe to the SalesMate YouTube channel and press the bell icon to stay updated on our new features, releases, and insightful videos.